Zamfara State Government has commenced renovation of the state secretariat and other government offices in the state. This, it believes, will enhance the productivity of workers. TVC News' Theophilos Darofai has more. The conducive working environment is a catalyst for employees' productivity. That is what the Zamfara State Government under Governor Dodo Lowell is putting in for its workers. The governor says on the assumption of office, the state secretariat was not befitting, but now wearing a new look. The head of service says the current administration prioritizes workers' welfare, including prompt payment of salaries and providing a conducive working environment. The building was highly dilapidated. So most of the time during rainy seasons, workers stay away from the offices because of the fear that something may happen because they keep leaking everywhere. That serious and devastating infrastructural decay affects the performance of the civil servants. You need to have a befitting office if you really want to work. The decayed building is now transformed into a new structure, befitting structure, wherever civil servants go there and work, and it's well <coughs> furnished and they were embarking on reforms. We were working now on all the promotions, apart from bonuses, the welfare packages. In the coming days, civil servants in Zamfara will start enjoying subsidized meals during working hours. The organized labor also commended Mr. Lowell, describing him as a worker-friendly governor. We are going to have cafeterias, wherever workers will be going, they will purchase tickets, at the subsidized rate, then go and pay and take a proper meal for them to work properly. You need to, to feed well, you know, to have a healthy body that you come up with. And this is what the, His Excellency is planning. There is a time a pensioner will take two months without getting that is petty set pension. Our salary is prompt and often before 25. The Zamfara State Government encourages workers to reciprocate the gesture by rededicating themselves to duty and shown any act of corruption as anyone found guilty will face the full wrath of the law. TVC News